Ooh, what's up guys, Nerfs and Pizza. I'm back, bringing us another gameplay commentary. But today, the commentary is going to be something a little bit different. Today I'll be bringing you guys a funny life story that happened during school. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy that. But before I begin, quickly, I'd just like to talk about the gameplay. Uh, this is a two-for-one gameplay, so you're seeing two gameplays in the background. The first is a quick 15-0 to 0 on Hunted on Warhawk with a bunch of guns. And the other one is a Loki gameplay where I get a pretty fast Loki, around two minutes, to get the 15 gun streak and get the Loki. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy both those gameplays in the background. Now, let's begin with the story. So it was just a regular day at school, you know, nothing big was happening and I was in socials class and I think we were working on a map or something and I just finished it I was like okay done and then yeah so anyways we had to go staple like the rubric to the map so I go over to the teacher's desk I get the stapler and then I go head back to my desk now I started to staple it and I was stapling it properly but it somehow wasn't working I don't know how that works but the stapler wasn't working so I was like hmm maybe I should check the staples in there still so anyways I open up the, the first half of it and then I open up the cartridge where all the staples are and sure enough they're all there I just kind of adjusted them a tiny bit and then I put them back where they were and closed it up but for some reason instead of closing it up I thought I did I thought I forgot that I should have closed it on the table like by pressing it together to close it but instead I ended up closing it with my thumb so then um, that's what happened I didn't even notice this because because I closed it and I was like is it closed and then and then I realized it was closed afterwards and then the guy sitting beside me he's got a YouTube channel by the way uh, I might put his link down below. Anyways, I, the guy behind, beside me looks at me with like this shocking face like, whoa, and then I'm just like, what? And then I look down at my thumb and I see that there's a staple inside my thumb. So I'm like, oh, I get that kind of goosebump feeling where I'm like, whoa, what, what just happened? And then, um, yeah, so I wasn't freaking out or anything. I was just, oh, cool, there's a staple there. And then anyways, right after that, um, we get the teacher. We just say, oh, we need to go get this out of here. So, and yeah, so we head down to the office. I, They called on for some student responders, and they just basically help out with any small injuries that happen around the school. And then anyways, yeah, we got to the room, and I explained them the story, how I stapled my thumb. And that was pretty funny. They cleaned it off. Removed the staple, both sides. It was about, uh, it wasn't too deep into my skin, but it was, it didn't hurt too much removing it. But anyways, that's pretty much the story. Um, so even today, you can, like, I, it's been healing for about like a year now, but for two weeks, you could clearly see the dots, like the two small dots on my thumb. And nowadays, if you look at my thumb, you can still see the two dots if you look close enough. So, yeah, it's pretty. That was a pretty crazy story. You know, nothing, nothing happens like that anymore. And um, yeah, for a couple, day, couple, oh, like I'd say about one week after that happened, I was kind of a little bit scared of staplers. You know, I was just like, oh, maybe you should do this for me, maybe. But uh, yeah, everything's good now. Uh, nothing no more problems with staplers i know how to close it properly now but yeah anyways so that's it for the story hope you guys enjoyed uh please don't forget to drop a like and comment and i'll see you guys later i'm out you already know what, what's happening peace